It's something about just having your camera or your phone out. People look at you weird. Hello, my name is Demoria and welcome back to my channel. I'm glad to be here. Hope you are as well. All right, so today I'm doing something a little different and I'm excited about it because whenever I film, I feel very weird about going out in public and filming. It's something about just having your camera or your phone out. People look at you weird. So I've been looking at these glasses online on Amazon. I've been eyeballing them and they went on sale. So I went ahead and made my purchase. They are the Oho Sunshine camcorder glasses. The normal price I've seen was $180. And they dropped down thirty dollars. The price is one fifty, so I went ahead and bought them. I did the unboxing yesterday because I actually took them for a spin. That way, I could test them out before I actually, you know, do the real deal. It's gonna be a spin today because I'm still new to them. They're new to me, but I can capture some better footage than I did yesterday. Yesterday, I did a horrible job. It comes in this box with the brand name all over it. Inside the box is this cute little carrying case. It is a brown leather hard case with the brand name on the front, Oho. And when you open it up, you get the glasses inside of a little bag. This is what they look like. They're like a tortoiseshell color. So it's like a really deep brown. They have the name here on the side. A lot of the styles I saw look curved, like the type of glass that a guy might wear to a racetrack, like just not my style at all. I like this. It has like that Ray-Ban shape to them really cute. They're dirty. I need to clean them. You also get a cleaning cloth for all the nasty fingerprints with the brand name on it as well. Lenses so you can switch from glasses to shades. I have not tried these yet. I don't know if I'll ever change them. I just don't want to be bothered with it. I don't want to break them. <laughs> you could actually still use these if the lenses break. I mean, the camcorder is in the center. If you don't have lenses here, you'll be okay. You'll just look weird. In the package, you also get a remote so you can operate your glasses without actually having to hit the button that is on the earpiece on the right side. A charging cable that connects to your computer. That way you can upload all your footage, an instruction guide, and a blue light test area card, which I do not know how to use and I probably won't. There are two ways that you can upload your images after you film. You can actually use your USB cable to connect to your computer, or you can download the app, which is OmniDash. I'll try to use the app and show you guys while I'm filming. Well, not while I'm filming, but I'll try to show you guys both the app and how it does with downloading using the power cable or the USB cable. <laughs> Me trying to speak tech language struggling okay i'm gonna try to really and it's gonna go back down too this is my roommate coming in the garage come on as soon as i start back talking she gonna lower the garage door all right let me try these on for you guys so you can see what they look like i think they're really cute i got that nerd look which i'm into the button is right up under here i'm gonna turn them on you're gonna hear it buzz Oh, I was gonna say, like, don't make a liar out of me. And when I take them off, I'll show you the indicator light so you'll know they're operating. You see the little light right there flashing on and off. So that is how you know they're off. I made the mistake of putting them in my bag while I was still filming because I didn't check the light. I just heard them buzz. When you first turn them on, they're filming. If you hit it a second time, it'll take a photo. But if you hold it, then they'll power off. So that's the mistake I was making. So if I click it again, it took a picture. And if I hold it and let it go, it goes off. The indicator light is off. So yeah, that's how you operate them. In order to charge them the same side where the button is, just remove that tip and there you go. That is how you charge and connect it to your laptop or computer. It looks just like an Android fitting and when you plug it in it doesn't go completely okay when you plug them in the silver part doesn't go all the way in so don't try to force that when you plug them in you'll hear it buzz just like it buzzes to indicate that it's filming and the red light will come on to let you know they're charging 
and be really gentle with it just kind of wiggle it out it's a really tight fit i don't know why it's like that kind of makes me nervous about it yeah this is my new toy that i'm really excited about let me give you some specs here the field of view is landscape so that would be like for a video for youtube or you know like your tv it's not 4k I don't know if it's 1080p or that seven something. And what's the other one? The format is JPEG for photos. It has a built-in microphone, built-in memory. You don't need like a mini SD card. The battery stays charged for about two hours and you can connect it to Mac OS 10.7 or later and then the Windows 7 or later. And it does not indicate the film quality. That would be something we'll have to explore so what I'm going to do is go get dressed and I'm going to meet up with my friend Christina at a restaurant called Hobnob here in Atlanta, Georgia. I've been there a couple of times. Christina picked a restaurant and I didn't object to it. I'm kind of open. So I haven't been to Atlantic Station in a while. So we'll see what's popping over there. And I'm going to take you guys with me. So let me get dressed. I'll show you my outfit I put together and we'll head out. All right, guys, this is my outfit for the day. I have on a button down blouse with a little flower detail on here. The top came from Forever 21. I have shorts on. The shorts are from Shein. Shein is always so big, but it's okay, we move. I have a pair of flip-flops I'm gonna wear, but these are the shoes I'm gonna wear. And this is my bag. Some no-name brand bag I got from Amazon. Not really crazy about it, but it works. I'm trying to get y'all this B-roll, but shoot, this. There we go. Fits nicely. Put these on. All right. We're ready. Eating that hot hot knob you said? Yeah. All right. Let's do a video here. Okay, guys. I am at Atlantic Station right now. It's about 3.02. So it's a beautiful day. It's not dark outside. It just looks like that because I'm in a parking deck. But I am parked outside of Dealers waiting on my friend Christina to get here. And while I was on my way, I wore my shades or glasses because they're interchangeable they can be shades and glasses i wore these on my way here on the drive i don't know what that looks like but i did actually wear these yesterday and just kind of sampled them and i i think the quality is awesome while i wait on christina i'm gonna take my little headband off and make sure my hair looks decent and then when she gets here i will go inside and I'll try to do a better job than I did yesterday. Yesterday was a trial run and I did a lot of walking so the footage was bouncy and I didn't pan enough. I realized that whenever I'm inside of a restaurant or a store and I want you to see the view that I'm seeing, I need to stand still and kind of just pan my head around. Like so, so I'm gonna try that today and see how it looks. And I'm gonna try to do like a little food review because that's really the whole point that's why i have these so yeah let's go walk around and play it on christina
All right, guys, the sun is really sunning today. I really need my little shade lenses inside of my glasses if I'm gonna be out here like this, because it's bright. But I think my battery might have died whenever I went to Bath, Bed Bath, no, not Bed Bath and Beyond, Bath and Body Works. And they like had this long extended bud, so I just took them off and put them in my purse. I'm going to the house now. I picked up a few things. And I had to take my earrings off and put my other ones back on. I bought this while I was at H&M and I meant to wear it, but I forgot. So we ate at Hot Knob. I had the black and salmon tacos, which is an appetizer. You get three tacos. Like, I don't understand why it's an app. I had the Moscow Mule and Christina had a Long Island iced tea. Christina is so much fun. This girl needs her own YouTube channel. She is hilarious. It was a good time. And now I am headed to the house so I can wrap up this video. I'm going to show you guys how to upload the images from the glasses to the laptop. And then I'm also going to pull the app up and try to figure out how that works. So I'll see you guys in a few minutes. All right, guys, so I am back at the house, obviously. And I just lit my brand new candle that I got from Bath and Body Works. So I almost said Bad Bath and Beyond, but I caught myself. But anyway, I'm about to, hmm, I really don't know what I'm about to show you. I think I'm about to show you how to upload the images from the camcorder glasses onto the computer. Then I'll try to show you the Bluetooth. I'm up here acting like I'm professional, and I'm really not. So don't expect a whole lot. All right, so I just opened up one of the folders, D, I, M, C, I think, and then movie. Ooh, Lord, it's a lot of stuff on here. So let's just go ahead and go with this one. So this is just to give you an idea of what it's like to upload the photos into your computer. And um, it's really bouncy. This is my very first time using the glasses, so... I didn't really realize how bouncy it was going to be because you don't know until you start using them. And the next thing I'm going to do is the Bluetooth connection. All right, so in order to connect these to Wi-Fi, you need to go ahead and go to your app store and get the OmniDash app. But once you get the, the app, you turn your glasses on by pressing this button twice. The blue light is now flashing, if you can see. So it's ready to be connected to Wi-Fi. 
and then I can connect it to my phone. So I'll screenshot that so you can see a screen record. Oh, look at this. All right, this is a live feed. I click on videos. Okay, so this is not how you access your photos. Maybe you can, but yeah, this is a good way to kind of monitor your movement. I like this. That's pretty cool. Okay, let me stop right here. Now, if this is gonna be a real review, I actually gotta give you my thoughts on the product. So let me put them on, cause they're just so fly. It's 1080p, which is really good quality, but Whenever I compare it to my phone images, I think the phone quality is a little better. I don't know why, because my phone is also 1080p. I don't know where it fails. Maybe it's because the lens needs to be clean. The one thing I would say, I would suggest taking a power pad with you so you can charge them on the go. Um, I really don't know how long it takes for them to charge, but the battery lasts for two hours. There are a few other things I need to figure out, like how to empty the memory, because I don't want to one day record over footage that I haven't uploaded in my computer. The thing that I'll make a habit of is I'll come home, I'll go ahead and upload them that way. It's not lost. I really enjoy these glasses. I'm able to do what I wanted to, and that is to go out and about and get some footage without feeling strange. It's just a personal preference. That's the whole point of the glasses. So would I recommend these to you? Absolutely. Yeah, that is pretty much it. I've done everything I know how to do. I think I've done a lot, okay? I really hope you enjoyed spending my, basically my entire day with me. I gave you my first product review and it was technical. And I knew it would be, but if I knew it was going to be this much work, I probably wouldn't have told you I was going to show you how to upload the photos and do the Bluetooth connection, but we conquered. I enjoyed my time at uh, Hop Night with my friend, Christina. We did a little bit of shopping. I don't want to do a haul in this video. Well, it's not a haul. I bought an outfit. I don't want to do that in this video because it's going to be long and i think quite a few people may wind up falling victim to demoria's channel those that are actually looking to buy the camcorder glasses and i don't want too many dislikes on my video that's pretty much it so i hope you enjoy spending time with me i really enjoyed my time here with you guys if you like my video let me know by hitting that like button and subscribe to my channel there's more stuff to come and i will see you really soon talk to you later I'm gonna try it on and see what it looks like. Now, honey, <laughs> what am I thinking? I look like a fragile rock. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm out here looking crazy. You've been caught on the camera.